basically. I, well, for me, like, I didn't start dancing till I was 16. Like, which, like, when did you start? Like, I, like for the most part, a lot of people that are on show, like, they started at 2, 4, or 5, so yeah. starting at 16, like, I definitely felt like I had a, a disadvantage. But, um, I don't know, you just, for the show, present something different. That's all I can say. Like, I can't flip. I can't turn 18 <laughs> times. I can't jump. I'm not actually flexible. Like, I'm fairly mediocre as a dancer, but I know that I present myself, like, in its best form always and first and foremost. So, as long as you just give them something different, which is clearly what you are, then you just present that. You present it in its best form, and there's no way, they're not going to deny it. Like, at least... Like, I feel like every one of us, like, we're all amazing dancers, but, like, like, Lauren's Lauren, like, and you get her in her fullest form. So you just present yourself, and that's the best advice. I mean, it definitely helps if you can do tricks and all these things, but that's not what gets you, because when I went to the Seattle audition, there were, like, boys that were creating C-shapes with their legs. There was, like, it was so crazy, and I was just like, you've got, and I'm from Hawaii, like, I just flew out there. I was like, this, there's no way, like, absolutely no way, and it just... I don't know. It's there's no way you can prepare for it. You just go in there knowing that you want it and, that, and you'll get it. Like I guarantee you. So yeah, just truly, truly be yourself and present it. Okay. You said something about experience. Does it help? Um, I feel like as dancers, we're never to the point of you we're good learning. and we're perfect. Yeah. I don't think any dancer will ever say that. You're, and it's like a breakthrough almost every single day, every single job, every single audition you go through. Um, I think that's why we have so much passion for it and stuff because it's every single day we're growing to a new level. Um, so I did the choreography round for season five. Uh, which was a great experience and I got to sit back with the producer and we watched every single contestant come through there uh, And I got to witness on the other side of auditioning and watch what works and what doesn't work And most of the times the things that didn't work was just the confidence level Or these great hip-hop dancers would come up But they'd have their cap down here and they're here like you know and We're like wait a second. This is a TV show and these people you know You got to connect with your audience and how are they gonna see your eyes and connect with you if you you're not up there and you're not standing strong so that was one a lot of it is confidence but yeah experience helps going taking class going to meet people every single day any little thing that you'll get will help you get to that next level well, we need to wrap this up because these people need to do a quick costume change which I know you're all um, used to doing because stick around they are going we're going to watch a sizzle reel actually of season eight which like i said i was at the callbacks it's going to be another great season these guys are going to change and they're going to do a dance if you ever dreamed of dancing with so you think you can dance people here's your chance maybe you can try it out and thank you so much for taking time out of your obviously very busy schedules to come here this was great i had a lot of fun <laughs>